Detroit diesel engines are known around the world for dependability, power, and economy, as well as clean diesel technology. Knowing how to get the most out of your engine is an important part of professional driving. So let's take a look at what you can do to keep your engine running at peak performance both off and on the road. Before you get in and drive away in any vehicle, every trip should begin with a thorough engine inspection. Remember, don't take it for granted. You drive for a living, so be sure your engine is in good shape and road ready. Maintenance starts with you, the driver. As the first set of eyes and ears, the maintenance issues that you notice and how you handle them can make a huge difference in performance on the road. There are a few specific items that you should look for in your pre-trip inspection when driving a Detroit diesel engine. First, raise the hood and begin a thorough visual inspection of the components. Make sure to check harnesses to be sure none are cracked or damaged. Check the oil level before starting the engine. Be sure the vehicle is on a level surface. Too much oil can be just as damaging as too little. Look closely at all hose connections. Make sure that there are no oil or fluid leaks or cracks. Check that the overflow tank is full. Look at the fuel filter. The engine mounted fuel filter includes a water and fuel indicator light. This system needs to be drained if the indicator light is solid red. If the truck is equipped with a frame mounted fuel filter and the bulb is full of fuel, make sure to get your filter changed. Make sure to check your serpentine belt which drives the front mounted water pump, alternator and AC compressor. Your belt is self-tensioned, but observe any cracks, stress, or wear patterns in your circle of inspection. If your belt fails, your engine will not be able to operate. The AC compressor is designed with a breakaway clutch, so if it does seize up, the belt drive system will continue to operate the alternator and water pump without any problems. Check the exhaust manifold area and EGR components for leaks. The EGR delivery pipe will be hot when the engine is running and after shutdown. Remember not to use it for a grab handle. A black soot residue here may be a sign of a leak. And check the area around and under the vehicle for obvious signs of fluid leaks. With all these checks completed, you're ready to hit the road. Whether you're driving a manual or an automatic in the city or on the highway, Knowing your engine and how to operate it correctly will make you a safer driver. And driving safely will improve fuel economy and keep your vehicle rolling with less downtime. Remember, perform your engine inspection, make sure you understand engine performance characteristics, and use them to your advantage.